McLean based in Brewster, New York. He'll be celebrating his 38th birthday tomorrow. He's also been a two-time Olympic team gold medalist. He's had Pan Am gold to his credit, silver at the World Equestrian Games, and he has uh, scored some big wins throughout the uh, current season in both North America and Europe. He starts going away from home, and he adds 60 points. Another 70 there. We're now up to 130. 240 points. 90-point Oxer coming up, and that takes us to 330. 440, and right back around, it'll be 530 points. Again, efficiency between the fences certainly counts. 600 is now the total. 660. 780 points. 880. Remember the joker fence, only an option in the bonus round. Down with that fence, so we're still at 880. It will be 980 points. And through the finish line they will go with a 980 score. That uh, final obstacle coming after the tone, 53.809 was the time there. Ladies and gentlemen, there's a potential new lead on the horizon if they can clear the double or nothing. And here comes that tone. 20 seconds is the amount of time they have to try. 1,960, it will be a new top score. All right, so that's a new target score there. McLean Ward setting that standard. We have scores increasing with each passing round. So now we're gonna see if Jonathan McRae can improve on that. A very respectable effort by McLean Ward. Jonathan McRae has the challenge of beating it. He's here with the Elan Furter entry number